Hey guys, it's Hect here with a review of Bay Metal Legend IDZ Apocalypse Limited Edition box set. Now this is the DVD version. I already bought the Blu-ray a while back and I wanted to buy the limited editions. This was only, I, I could only find the DVD limited editions. I don't even know if they ever sold Blu-ray limited editions. And I couldn't find them on any English sites. I had to go to Japanese sites and then import it and it cost quite a bit of money. So this is pretty much only for super hardcore baby metal fans because even what's inside of it, I don't think it's that great. So let's just talk about it. And I'm not going to be talking about the concerts or what's on the discs because I already talked about that in a different review. I'm just talking about what's in the contents of the limited edition set. So real quick, the Blu-ray, it has three concerts on one disc, Legends, I, D, and Z, which I barely realized IDZ is, you know, Ijime, Dame, Zetai. And that's why they had IDZ. But whatever. Anyway, so it comes in this kind of like cardboard box. And you just pull it open. Oops. Inside is this little slip. It was a really thick slip. It says Bay Metal on one side. On the other, it says... Well, it has the set list for Legends I, D, and Z, the concerts. And then over here... We have the DVD set, and it is different from the Blu-ray. The picture, see the Blu-ray and the DVD. But it still says just Baby Metal Live Legend IDZ Apocalypse, and then it has three discs in this, dang it, this little cradle thingy. There's nothing else inside or in the back. But while there was something else, it was this kind of a cloak type thingy, which I had never seen anybody in Baby Metal wear during the concerts, before the concerts, or after the concerts. I only saw Sue Metal, Moa Metal, and Yui Metal wear them for an ad for the limited edition Baby Metal, um, Baby Metal Live Legend IDC limited edition. That's the only time I ever saw them wear this. It's, well, it has a little... Um, tag of what it's made out of. <clears throat> it's made out of 64% polyester, 32% rayon, and 4% polyurethane. It says you can iron it. Um, I guess you can wash it. Don't bleach it. I guess you can dry it. I don't know. It's all in Japanese, so I'm kind of like uh, on it. And it has this little logo on both ends. It's almost... The layout is almost like the hooded towels that they sold, but it is not a towel material, not really. It's more like, it's not even a row material. I don't know what you would call it. And then in the back, it says Babe Metal, as you can see. Oh, and then at the bottom of the back, it says Babe Metal Cross Beams, little tag. And then it has another one of those logos on the other side. Can't really tell how it looks with me sitting down, so here's a little video of me wearing it and kind of modeling it. Not Well, not really modeling it, you know, just showing it off. So it came within the big Baby Metal Live Legend IDC Apocalypse limited edition box, but they folded it in a way that it fit perfectly and then it was in a plastic bag, but I could not fold it back up to fit it back in the box. So I've just been keeping it outside of the box and that's why it wasn't in the box when I opened it up and all that good stuff. And here's the back of the box, and it is pretty damn cool. All the different little drawings. Of course, people who have seen the Concerts Legend I, D, and C may have seen some of these drawings during the animations in between some of the songs. And that's all there is to the Baby Metal Live Legend I, D, C Apocalypse Limited Edition DVD set. Um, again, this is really for only super, super hardcore Bay Metal fans because I don't know who else would be wearing this outside and I don't know who would want to pay such an incredible amount for these limited editions, if you can even find them. So yeah, thumbs up if you like this video or if you just appreciated me doing it because I haven't really seen any or very many Bay Metal limited edition reviews on YouTube, so hopefully I'm the first, I don't know, at least for this one. 
and subscribe to my channel because I plan to review the other Baby Metal Limited Edition sets. So if you want to see that, or if you want to see any of my other Japanese and otaku videos, sometimes I do vlogs, sometimes I do educational videos, sometimes I do product reviews like this. If you want to see any of that, definitely subscribe because more is going to be coming in the future.